Lydia, we're all here. Any chance you might tell us why? At least one of you has a good idea. Sounds ominous. A something happened? I think we can safely say that. Yeah. Oh, my God. We'll get on with it then. Some of us haven't got all day. Oi! Don't talk to Lydia like that. Sam. Sos. We'll be here as long as it takes to get to the truth. The truth about what? I had a call from Billy this morning. He was out on home farm land and he, he made a very grim discovery. When you say grim? He found a body. Seriously? It's not something you joke about. Who was it? Craig. How exactly? I mean, has he fallen? Oh, stop playing the innocent. I mean, come on, we all know everyone's been plotting to get him. But for the record, according to Billy, he'd been beaten. Don't look at me, I didn't touch him. And why was he up there in the first place? Maybe he was meeting someone. Or he was dumped. Not by me, before anyone asks. Yeah, well, we'll see about that, won't we? But obviously somebody here knows more than they're letting on. Hang on, so you actually think one of us might have done it? Well, can you blame me? After all the threats and violence that have been flying around. Yeah, but that's what people do when they feel threatened, isn't it? You know, Craig turned up to a pub like that, shouting the odds. I mean, it was out to wind everyone up. Yeah, he obviously managed it. Well, just so you know, the police are at home farm now. And it's only a matter of time before they come knocking on our doors. I don't mean we'll tell them anything. <clears throat> and does that go for me and all? Is anyone going to tell me the truth? Or am I going to be met with a dingle wall of silence? All right, OK. Well, it looks like we're going to have to do this the hard way. Sam, why don't you tell us all what you were doing yesterday? Hey, why do I have to go first? Because I already know that you and Kane kidnapped Craig and had him tied up in a barn, don't I? Seriously? What is wrong with you? Is that what you meant when you told me you'd saw it? This is nothing like how before you all start kicking off. So what was it like? Come on, give us the inspired logic that ran through your br... your brains. I'd be careful if I were you. We have to do something. I know you told us to leave him, but you heard him in the pub earlier, lying through his teeth, and now he's got his lawyers threatening to sue our bell. You can't just kidnap someone, Sam. You can't just force yourself on someone either. But he did that to you, and now he's getting away with it. This is so wrong. The police won't charge him, so we've got to do something. What, like taking the law into your own hands, you mean? Works for me. Only this isn't justice, is it? It's revenge. Well, right now, this is all you're going to get. Look, he's here. Nothing's going to change that. We just wanted to give you the chance of having it out with him. What? Two men thinking that they're saving my honour? You really have no idea, do you? Well, if you want us to let him go, just say the word, we won't lay a finger on him. Very big of you. But before you do that, if there's anything you want to say to him, anything you want to do to him, it might be your only chance. So, hang on. You've brought us all here when you already knew about this. Why didn't you just have it out with these two instead? I didn't kill Craig, so don't even go there. Got to admit, it all looks a bit sus. First story we hear and you three are in at the deep end. I wasn't there by choice, believe me. Sam texted me and I had no idea why. Kane, and his not-so-original, brilliant ideas. At least he did something. Cos tying someone to a chair is the perfect solution. Go on, you two. Lydia's trying to tell us what happened. Go on, Lydia. I froze. You know, seeing him there. All the... all the memories of what he did to me came flooding back. And I know I should have told him to untie him and let him go. Well, you couldn't. 
I'm not proud of it. But it, it was as if the tables had been turned and I had the power over him. Not to hurt him or anything like that. I hope you give him both barrels of flaming cherry on top. I just wanted him to admit the truth. Well, you deserve that and a damn sight more besides. Question is, did you get it? Take his gag off him. Sure. What if he starts screaming or something? I'm in the middle of nowhere, aren't we? There's no one to hear him, even if he does. If you try anything stupid. To jump me, shoved it back on my head. I thought they were going to kill me. And yet here you are. How does it feel? How do you think it feels? They're crazy. Please, tell them to stop. Why should I do anything for you? Because look at me. I'm the victim here. These last few weeks, your family has defamed me, threatened me, now this. What about what you did to me? Or are you still going to pretend like it never happened? I know I shouldn't have come in the pub like that. But I was angry. I was upset with all the accusations flying around. You raped me! I know you feel guilty about what happened, but you can't deny we've always had a connection. I'm giving him connection. My 